Hey friends, welcome to the YouTube channel all about electronics. So in this question, we have been given this circuit and we have been given that the threshold voltage for the each MOSFET in the circuit is equal to 2 volt. So for this circuit to work as an inverter, we have been asked to find what should be the value of the input voltage. So we know that for the inverter, when the input is equal to logic 0, then its output is equal to logic 1. And whenever the input is equal to logic 1, then its output is equal to logic 0. Where this logic 1 and the logic 0 corresponds to the supply voltage which is connected with the circuits. So in this case if you see, then the PMOS is connected with the ground terminal while this NMOS transistor is connected with the minus 5 voltage. That means in this case, the input should also be equal to 0 and the minus 5 volt. But let us see with these voltages whether the circuit will work properly or not. So first, let's say the input is equal to 0 volt. So when the input is equal to 0 volt, then the gate voltage for both MOSFETs is equal to 0 volt. So for the PMOS, if we see, then the source terminal is also connected to the ground terminal. That means for the PMOS transistor, this Vs is also equal to 0. And if we see the Vsg or this Vs minus Vg, then that is equal to 0. And since it is less than the threshold voltage, so this PMOS transistor will remain in the off condition. On the other end, for this NMOS transistor, if you see, then the gate voltage is also equal to 0. But here, the source voltage is equal to minus 5 volt. That means here, this voltage VGS, that is Vg minus Vs, is equal to 0 minus minus 5 volt that is equal to 5 volt and since VGS is more than the threshold voltage so this NMOS transistor will remain in the on condition that means whenever this input is 0 then this NMOS transistor is in the on condition and because of that it will act as a short circuit and due to that this output voltage will be close to the minus 5 volt similarly let's see what happens when the input voltage is equal to minus 5 volt? And first, let us see what happens with this PMOS transistor. So for this PMOS transistor, this gate voltage will be equal to minus 5 volt. On the other end, if we see this source voltage, then this Vs is connected to the ground terminal. That means this Vs is equal to 0 volt. That means for this PMOS transistor, if we see this source to gate voltage or this Vsg, then that is equal to is 0 minus minus 5 volt that is equal to 5 volt and since this voltage is more than the threshold voltage so this PMOS transistor will remain in the on condition on the other end if we see this NMOS transistor then for this NMOS transistor this VG is also equal to minus 5 volt but at the same time this source is also connected to the minus 5 volt that means here this VS is also equal to minus 5 volt. That means for this NMOS transistor, if we see this gate to source voltage, then that is equal to 0. And since it is less than the threshold voltage, so this NMOS transistor will remain in the off condition. That means whenever this VIN is equal to minus 5 volt, then this PMOS will be on and the NMOS transistor will be off. And since the PMOS transistor is in the on condition, so it will act as a short circuit. And due to that, this output voltage will be very close to the 0 volt. And in this way, this circuit is acting as an inverter. That means for the given circuit to work as an inverter, the input voltage should be equal to minus 5 volt and the 0 volt. And therefore, for the given question, this B is the correct answer.